lovely. So today I am going to be opening my Wantables Intimates box. Yes, this is actually the Intimates box. So I'm super duper excited. There's been a lot of changes um, to Wantable sites because they really listen to their customers and any complaints or suggestions we have. So I'm just going to get right into it because I am really freaking excited and this has been sitting here for like two or three days and it's been driving me nuts. So they put this paper in there. Oh, sorry, Bella. Put this paper in there. Okay, so there's another paper that just has like your, what they are and I'm going to keep these so I can, there's only three items in this. Oh, okay, so they said that they were going to put less items in the box because the items that they do put in the box are supposed to be better quality. But that makes me sad. I'd rather get five less, well, how do you say that? Not as good quality things because I just like getting lots of things. So maybe I'm greedy? I don't know. But yeah, there's only three things in here and that kind of sucks. But anyways, that's just my opinion. But this, the first thing that I see here are these. And they look like tights, which would not be good because I dislike tights. Let's see here. Ultra soft and cozy Mook Luke's fleece lined leggings will keep you warm this fall and winter. <gasps> okay, let me show these to you guys. Mm, okay. Because they feel so thin. How are they fleece lined? So they're this really dark chocolate brown. They look like they're made for toddlers, but they're like tights, I guess. They really don't look like leggings because leggings really look like pants normally but these would be really super cute under a dress let's just get to the point here Emily just get to the point okay so this is the inside it fleece okay so the inside of it feels like when you get a brand new sweatshirt that like how it's like soft and fuzzy on the inside and then after one wash it's not so that's what it feels like on the inside it doesn't I guess it kind of feels like fleece, but they are really, really, really super thin. So that's kind of really cool. I thought like by fleece line, it would be like this. I'm really excited. These would be so nice and warm. And they're built like tights. Like the front is just one seam and the back has like a butt. I think that's how. Or maybe this is the opposite way. Front has vagina section and the butt just has a crack I don't know I don't wait let's look at the there's no indications on the inside so you're just gonna have to figure it out when you put them on yep who knows I haven't worn tights or anything in so long because last year we went to Florida super early so okay the next thing is another item from Mux Lux. I'll say it a different way this time. Maybe one of them will be correct. Um, these look really cool. Um, oh, so those leggings are twelve dollars and fifty cents. High quality. Like that's not expensive. Um, that's like super, super, super cheap. Maybe they're better quality, but not as like still not very expensive. I don't know. Um, oh, I should change the angle so you guys can see Bella making her cave and embarrass her like a true mother would. Okay, so there are these long knee-high socks, which I really like because I like to wear them. And then I like to pull them down. What I really like to do is put boots on and then pull them down so they're like scrunched. Okay, she's done making her cave. Um, so these are pretty cool. I think they're really pretty and they're gray so you can wear them with like brown or black. Okay, these are over the knee featured, blah, 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 exactly what I just said. So these are knee high muck luck socks in neutral, $15. So these are pretty cool, but if you didn't like this company, that would suck for you because two out of the three items are from there, so. Okay, so the next thing is a dot PJ set in bright and it's by Nuvo. By Pajama Drama. 
Oh, I think I've gotten these before. Okay, so the top. Yay, it's a tank tank top. Oh, look how cute. Look at the bottom. It has like a lace and it has, it's longer in back. So it kind of covers your booty. I, this is like a really pretty shirt. <laughs> like this would be a really cute just shirt. So gotta love that because I'll probably wear it with black leggings somewhere outside of my house. That is so pretty. I can't believe these are pajamas. And then just like a racer back. It does look pretty big, but it's kind of nice when these things can shrink a little bit. Just so you know, the detail of that, this part down here is what's doubled up on here. So it's really pretty. And then the bottoms. Hopefully they're long. Hopefully they're long. Yes. They're long pants. And they just are little cute on top. It does suck. I like when companies do um, ties because I love, love, love my pajama bottoms to be like boy size, like humongous, and then tie them like really tight around my waist so they're, so they're really loose everywhere else. Okay, good. They have a big bottom because some get really skinny at the bottom and I don't like that. I feel like constricted or something. So that's all I have to show you guys. These are... $39.99, so $40, which is, these are, that's like, all of these things are what I would pay normally at, like, Walmart for these things, honestly. I mean, they make maybe $30 for a super nice pajama set for $10 off. I don't know. I'm not really super impressed with their new, um, you know, less items but better quality kind of thing because... If I'm going by retail prices, which are usually astronomical for Wonderfuls, like if you've watched any of my other unboxings, like I kind of freak out when I do the retails because I'm like, who on earth would pay this? Like if you pay this, I will kill you. Um, but these, I would all pay this for these. So I don't know what to say about it. And it doesn't have any... Um, Maybe I didn't give them any instructions, so it doesn't have the note thing. But anyways, this is my November Intimates. I really liked all three items. Sorry, I didn't mean to seem like I didn't like them. I did like them all, but especially for unboxing purposes, it's really fun to show more than three things. But I guess it's better to like them than dislike them. Um, but I love my Intimates box. I always do. If you're interested, I'll have all the information down below. I have a clicky thing that you can click on that gives me credit or something. I don't know what it actually does, but it gives me like a dollar off of my next subscription box so I can keep on doing these unboxings. But you can always just go to onceable.com. That just works perfectly fine as well. I don't want to be misleading at all. But anyways, um, I hope you guys are having a pretty stress-free day. And I'm sending out X double O's. And my hand just like freaked out. I look really like, ooh, um, double O's. And as always, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.